Hey guys, we have here our JBL Vibe Buds and in this video we want to show you how to pair these earbuds to an Android smartphone. So in case you do have an iPhone, then I suggest you check out my other video here in the upper right corner where, for, where we're explaining it, how to do it for that kind of smartphone. So, but now let's get started. Uh, so now the very first thing when our earbuds are still brand new is that we have to activate them. And that's really easy. You just see when you pull both of the earbuds out of the charging case and you see this little piece of plastic here that's stuck in between them. This is just covering the uh, two uh, charging points on the back side of the earbuds. And we're just going to pull that piece of plastic off. We're going to throw that away. We're not going to use that anymore. And then to, in order to activate them, we just place both earbuds back into the charging case just for a second. And then we should see here at the front of the of the uh, charging case that this LED lights up just for a few seconds. And this means now the earbuds are activated. And uh, so now we can start pairing them to our smartphone. In order to do that, we're just going to pull both earbuds out of the charging case again. And then we're going to take a look at the side of the earbuds. And that's where we find this little blue LED. And uh, that LED is supposed to blink rapidly at this point. So that indicates that the earbuds are right now in the Bluetooth pairing mode. If this is not the case for you, then we have to uh, manually bring them into the pairing mode. And we do this by double tapping on one of uh, on the side of one of the earbuds and on the second tap we're going to press and hold we're going to hold this for five seconds and that will then activate the bluetooth pairing mode and now let's switch to our android phone and in case you do have a newer model phone that supports the google fast pairing then there's going to be automatically a pop-up coming up that provides this little information about the JBL Vibe Buds and all we have to do is just accept to pair them and so there's a couple of different steps that you can do afterwards uh, but you can actually step, uh, skip all those steps if you wanted to and then we have already completed the pairing process and we can also see a little bit of information here so we can use these earbuds for phone calls as well we, to just listen to music or um, just general audio and we can also see here the battery percentage of the earbuds at this point so right now the batteries are full they're at 100 percent now in case the fast pairing pop-up does not come up in your smartphone then we can do the bluetooth pairing process manually all we have to do is here swipe down on the phone and we're going to see these settings icons or this cockwheel icon to go into the settings here we find connections and then we have here Bluetooth. We're going to enter this and then we're going to make sure to turn on Bluetooth. And then the phone is going to search for all kinds of Bluetooth devices in our vicinity. And you're going to see the JBL Vibe beam in there. And all we have to do then is select them and that will also pair our Bluetooth earbuds. Now, once we are done using the earbuds in order to turn them off, all we have to do is place them back in the charging case. So this will recharge the batteries. And once the batteries are full, charging process will be stopped and uh, we can still leave them in there so now the uh, earbuds are going to be disconnected from our smartphone you see this here now it's not connected anymore and the next time we want to use our earbuds again all we have to do is pull them out of the charging case and they're going to turn on automatically and also they're going to reconnect uh, really quickly to our smartphone you can see this here within like a second they are now reconnected to our smartphone and they're ready to be used we don't have to go through this pairing process anymore so at this point now, as long as your smartphone still has Bluetooth enabled, they are ready to be used immediately. Okay, so this was already it for this video. Hope you found the information helpful. And if you have any more questions or comments, then please leave a message below.